So, running into a little bit of a space issue. I need more storage. I need storage. Now, I didn't want to buy a bunch of plastic totes to put everything in. Um, because I feel like they just, it's not safe. So I want to hang all these on pegs. So I'm going to do a project today. I've got a, um, unused cabinet and I'm going to put some pegboard in it, put some pegs in it, paint it blue, and it will be hot wheel storage. So stick around. So this is the cabinet, it's down here in the basement, and the plan is, basically, I'm going to put pegboard in the back. I've ordered a bunch of 12 inch um, pegboard pegs, and then we'll just fill it up with mainline Hot Wheels. And I think we'll leave the shelf in and uh, Maybe put some pegs in the top too and hang some extra premiums up there. So yeah, to the garage. So this is the plan. Pegboard. Just going to cut this to length for support. Then this will slip into the back of the cabinet and then along the ends of the board like this just drill that into the side of the cabinet and then I'll be hanging in the cabinet see how see how it works So that should be pretty well supported now. I'm going to take it downstairs and uh, give it a test fit. So let's see if it fits. That might be just snug enough that I don't even have to secure it. I will still. <clears throat> but that fits pretty perfect in there. So what I'll do is I'll come over here and just drill a pilot through here and here. 
on the uh, on all those boards and just secure it in there and that'll be it I was originally planning on painting it blue but I don't think I'll bother because it'll be full of cars anyway I think that'll be it awesome I can't wait to get the cars up So I just pulled the backing off a little bit just to give myself a line of sight for where the boards are. And I'll tack that back in after, but everything looks very, very flush already, except for this one. So we'll uh, drill it in place and that'll be it. Put you on time lapse and check it out. So, there we are, all secured in place, ready for pegs. Bad news for me, I have to wait until tomorrow for the pegs to be delivered. Good news for you, you'll be seeing it right now. Enjoy. So, through the magic of film, it's the next day, pegs have arrived, I've already set up the top layer decided on the layout um the spacing was a little weird so um instead of having two big gaps on either side since this is for storage primarily and not display i decided to pack five a little more to the right and then leave the left side a little more spaced so i can put premiums the bigger premium cards on there and then i'll put the main lines on the five so, set you up for a time lapse and uh, fill the pegs. Fill the board and then fill the pegs with cars. Let's go. So I decided to save you the indignity of looking at my backside for uh, any more time. But uh, that's it. Pretty happy with that. Hopefully, uh, you know, I didn't calculate <laughs> how much weight this actually is in here. So these are, you know, average uh, 10 cars deep on these 12 inch pegs. Um, I don't even know how many pegs I put up. I guess about 47 pegs. So, hopefully I secured it enough to the back and we don't have another incident like the wall, but you know, I guess the lesson is don't hire me to uh, engineer anything. But we'll see, I'm pretty stoked with that. So, everything. Safe and sound. I think I might put a light up there. Like a uh, library light. And then put a switch right here so that when the doors open, the switch releases like a, like a fridge. And it'll shine down on there. 
that'd be cool anyway thanks for watching see you at the next hunt